This is problem number three for section 3.1. In this problem it says find the slope of the function's graph at the given point. Then find an equation for the line tangent to the graph there. So they want us to find the slope of this, uh, this function's graph at this point, but they also want us to write the tangent line uh, for that spot. So the first thing we want to do is we want to say we're going to find the slope. And I'm going to kind of say slope expression because that's what we're really looking for to begin with. The slope expression is going to be the limit as h approaches 0 for f of x plus h minus f of x all over h. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this function and we're going to plug in x plus h into it and then same thing with x and we're going to evaluate this limit. And notice when I plug in 0 right now, I get a division of 0, so our goal is to cancel h. So we're going to say equals f of x plus h. So let's take that function. So we're going to say x plus h squared minus 8 minus the original function, which is x squared minus 8. That's going to be all over h, which is going to equal Let's go ahead and evaluate x squared plus a, or not x squared, plus h, uh, x plus h squared. Well, that's going to be x plus h times x plus h, which will give you x times x, which is x squared. x times h is xh. h times x is also xh, so that's two of them. And then h times h, which is h squared. So I can plug that in for this here, and we get x squared plus 2xh plus h squared minus 8 minus x squared plus 8 all over h. Negative x squared cancels with x squared. Negative 8 cancels with 8. And we're left with, I should have put ditto for these for the limit. I always forget that limit as h approaches 0 of 2xh plus h squared all over h, which we can factor out an h on the top. So we got limit as h approaches 0 of h, 2x plus h left inside over h. And you can see the h's cancel, which is nice. That's our goal. And so now we have the limit as h approaches 0 for 2x plus h, which is going to equal, when I plug in 0, that'll be 2x plus 0, which equals 2x. So this is the expression for the slope for this function x squared minus 8 for any slope on this curve. Now, uh, we're looking for a specific slope at negative 4, 8. So we're going to write that we want to find the slope at negative 4, 8. So that means we're going to take 2x and we're going to replace the negative 4 for the x value and that tells us that our slope at that point is negative 8. And now we want, and by the way that's the first part, so I'm going to kind of circle this, and then they want us to find the tangent line. Tangent line is going to be y equals negative 8x plus b. We're going to plug in negative 4 and 8, so that's 8 equals negative 8 times 4 plus b. So we get 8 equals negative 32 plus b. Add this over, we get 40 equals b. So our tangent line is y equals negative 8x plus 40. Oh, you know what I screwed up? I meant to put this as negative 4. Whoops, this is negative 4 here. I made a little mistake. This should be plus 32. So when I subtract that over, that should be negative 24. So I'm going to cross this out. And this is actually y equals negative 8x minus 24.
Little mistake though, you gotta watch out for when you plug this cord in, making sure you plug in the negative with it. So this is the tangent line for this function at this point. 